Welcome to the Crazy Town Podcast. I'm Jonas. And I'm TNT Don. I'm like the explosive one. Let's crack into another one. TNT. Yo. So you chose awful yesterday. I did. Today's weird. All right, I'll take the weird. So, all right. So I'm, so like I'm on a, uh, I'm on a dating site. You are on a dating site. Yeah. It's the personal tale. Yes. Okay. So, uh, in one of the dating sites, they, they, a pop-up popped up yesterday and they're like, do you want to try speed dating? And I was like, mm. on an app? I was like, all right, whatever. I was waiting to go to volleyball league. I didn't have anything to do. I was sitting in a chair. All right. All right. So you're searching grinder and yeah. The, yeah. I'm gr- so and you get the speed dating app. on So, Grindr. Uh, gotcha. so at first I thought it was like, cause it said talk, how it works is like mm-hmm. you talk to somebody for three minutes mm-hmm. and then, and then you get to see whether you want to match with them or not. So okay. it's like you talk to them blind, and then it like shows you like their picture. Okay. So I was like, "Oh, that's cool." So yeah, like, that's pretty cool. I thought it was audio, so I was like, "Oh, that's kind of weird." It's not. It's just text. All right. So um, match. Right. With, I I I chat with a couple people, whatever. Good banter, like whatever. So then finally, I think this is like my third thing. So it's three minutes at a time, right? So, and I'm and this girl's like, "Hey," and I'm like, "Hey," and uh, I said, "Hey, are you?" In, I said, "Are you in Austin?" And she said, "Yeah." And then I fucking, bro, she, the next thing she asked me, she goes, do you have pure blood? Oh. And I was like. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait. I like where this is going. And I, well, right. And I, I go. Like where this is going. And All I right. go, pure blood? Yeah, man. And, thir- she, and 13, she goes. 13 words, Jonas. What the fuck? She goes, yeah, anti-vax. Oh. And, and I go. And I just ignored her. And I literally was like, so what do you like to do for hobbies? And she was like, I, whatever she likes to do. This is all in three minutes, mind you. Second, are you pure blood? And I said, I don't even know what that means. Yeah, that's a weird Oh, thing. no, no. She didn't say anti-vax until I said, I don't know what that means. And she said, anti-vax. And I said, I literally was like, ha, 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 ha. Is that really a thing that people ask people? <laughs> And she was like, yes. And I was like, so what do you like to do? Finally, she just typed in all caps, pure blood, question mark. And I was like, oh, I was like, and and by that time, the time was just about to expire. And then it popped up. She was 51 years old. I don't know how the hell I got matched up with a 51 year old lady to talk. I was like, so this 51 year old lady, the first thing she's curious about with any person she's going to potentially date is that they have pure blood and that's how she's going to ask. But oh, there's so so much, so much, so much to cover here. Yeah, and yeah. I just thought it was so great much. to bring up because I was I was flabbergasted. I was like, this is weird. Okay, so Jonas, round one. When you first heard pure blood, what first came to your mind? What did you think? I thought I'll tell you what I. I thought, thought she was talking about actually. Say it. Just fucking say it. Stop. Actually, dancing. I didn't know what she was talking about. But now that you said that, I'm like, oh, she think I, does she mean like KKK? Like okay, Ari- thank you. That's Aryan, what I'm thinking. White blood. Like I'm thinking 13 words. Like you know, we must. You got to protect white race, and you got to be purely white. Are you pure white, Jonas? <laughs> She's like, are you pure blood? And Jonas, <laughs> I can tell you from right over here, you are. <laughs> wow. You're pure blood. Wow. I got. I got to take it to the mothership, bro. You're pure blood. Pure blood. You are. So Jonas never even seen a white a black pussy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling you, he has. I've been to a strip club. <laughs> 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 he didn't even deny it. That's <laughs> the funniest part. He didn't even deny it. Uh, that's hilarious. Anyway, so yeah, that's what I thought eventually, originally. But right. now that I see it's she wants to know if you're anti-vax. Question. Go what, ahead. What does it matter? Well, well, that's my thing. I was like, first I was like, okay, COVID is pretty much, it's just a, a, now it's just an illness that you might get and you're out of work for a few. It's not nearly as severe. I mean, they don't even do real. I mean, yeah, I guess they're coming out with new vaccines, but I'm like, I guess my, my question was like, you're 51. She's a, she's a we, we, ain't, we ain't having babies. Like, what does it matter that's, if I have pure blood or not? I was going to get there. I was going to get there. I don't understand what her issue is unless, I mean, she isn't, she's getting, she's getting closer to that age where COVID could be a potential problem for, you know? Yeah, but But I don't know. Not really. And and I was just like, that's like, that's like what, 
I'm like, that just shows me how wild the damn world is. And I was telling somebody else that story and they were like, what the hell? And I'm like, you're lucky you're married because this is what online dating is nowadays. It is just insane. People are just like, are you pure blood is one of the first questions yeah. they ask you. And I'm going to tell you right now is that at 51 years old, she ain't a, she ain't a tastemaker. So I don't know if that's necessarily. What the fuck does that mean? A tastemaker? Yeah. Um. I mean, it's like the terminology that she's using may not be like the terminology that is canonically accepted. Um, to- oh, it's like grandma's from a different time. Yeah, it's like she's just making up her own lingo. Hold on a second. She was only 47 during COVID. It was three years ago. It ain't like she was. Uh, Joe, a- look, look at yourself. All right. Look at myself. What do yeah, you mean? You're You're way younger than her and you don't know shit. You didn't know who the fuck Ice Spice was until like uh, two days ago. <laughs> and I meant honestly, that was today. Yeah, <laughs> but, like, <laughs> to be honest, but, but yeah. So there, like, I so was, her and her friends are just sitting around talking about pure bloods. I'm sure is that you know people come up with their own colloquialisms, but I've never heard this term. Is that like I'm, calling people playgrats? It, the easiest way to find out Jonas cuz I honestly I don't know. I mean essentially yeah, playgrats. Yes, it would be the same thing cuz it was But the like, opposite. It was yeah. kind of like the thing we we share we'd be like look at these playgrats out here. You know. Yeah, yeah. Anyway, but yeah, I I just have to say it's like if you google it if it's on know your meme then it might be a real thing. I, but I've I'm never get heard... in trouble for googling that. I mean, you might end up on a watch list. <laughs> Pure blood, they're all like Jonas. But they're probably already watching me, so you're probably you're pretty screwed anyway. You can't get away with anything. Yeah. They've been watching me for years. Yeah, you know. My it, FBI agent, he hits me up every morning. He asks me uh, how I'm how I'm feeling today. How you feeling today? You got the you got the things? <laughs> I'm like, no, nope, not today, Steve. He's like, all right, maybe tomorrow. <laughs> but I just like I c if I just don't understand. You don't understand what? What's not that? It's like don't no matter what your preference is, she feels strongly about it. Yeah. Don't you feel coming at someone you've never met before that you're trying to like be have an intimate relationship by saying to them the first thing you say to them is like, "Do you have pure blood?" Don't you think that that's weird? Like, this, wouldn't do just I about, think it's wouldn't weird? just anyone think it's weird? I think it's weird to open up with that. I feel like that's like a, a bad thing to like. I don't know, stand on and have it be like your. Your yeah, ultimatum. Not like, how old are you? Do you have any kids? It's like, do you have pure blood? Yeah, because like it's, like I said, it's very off-putting to hear that. And like, I don't know if I were white and or black and I heard that, I'm going to be like thinking like, oh, is this lady racist? And that's going to be your initial <laughs> thing. And she'd be like, anti-vax. And I'd be like, so you're asking me if I got the vaccination or not? And, like, if, and if and, I did, you're just going to and it. Yeah, and then you're saying if I did, it's, there's no chance for this relationship? Look, just on principles, whether I did or not, I don't want to be with an, any person who bases whether or not they would start up a relationship with somebody based on that. Because yeah. I feel like even if I were to meet a female and she didn't or she did, it's not going to be like just like I judge you off of that. I judge you off of who you are, not necessarily whatever you fail for. Yeah, like if, <laughs> like scam if you used you to be a meth for. junkie and now you're not. Yeah. I, I mean, mean, hey, used to be a prostitute and now you're not. Hey, look, man, we've all fallen for scams, you know? Right? Ayo. We've all fallen for scams. I've had my bank account ro- robbed on cl- uh, around Christmas time in the past. So, you know, some mm-hmm. people fall for scams. So I'm not going to be mad at somebody because they fell for a scam. Ayo. Right? I mean, we've all been scammed. We've all been scammed. Yes, we've all been scammed. Whether it's like from from that or... So, realizing that it was a scam. Realizing what was a scam? Oh! Either way you want to look at it, my man. I don't know what you're talking about. What I'm saying. It's like people fall for stuff. You cool. hear something, you fall for it. Right? Oh, 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 oh! Like her, like diving into the pure blood pool. Sure, or you know the other way around, or me not diving into the pure blood. Pool. I don't know what you're talking. You're being I very, know. you're being very ominous for no reason. For a good reason, because I don't care either way you look at it. Because a lot of people are like, look, you can be anti-vax, and they're like, COVID was a scam, and a lot of people are like, uh, no, what you're talking about is a scam. So we've all fallen for scams. 
I mean, yeah, there's a there's lot. There's a of reason that I'm not side, I'm yeah. not putting the foot down on either one because I, it's no fools for me to care. say. I mean, I think you do. We're talking about it right now. We're talking about this crazy lady that hit you up with her. I just thought it was weird that she asked me that. I think it would have been cool if you had told her, uh, yeah, I'm a pure blood. 100%. Pick her brain. I want to know what the hell she does with I her didn't day. get long enough with her. I know, but it would have been so cool just to, like, you bring her over and get her on the podcast. I want to know what she watches on TV all day. <laughs> I want to know what her Facebook page looks like. Oh, dude, there's... Oh. There's some memes. I want to see how many American flags she has on shirts in her closet. <laughs> Eagles and shit. Not exactly. Wolf. Yeah, yeah. So, I don't know. Go to thecrazydown.com. Uh, if you're a pure blood, put it in the comments. <laughs> For Jonas. T -T. Oh, yeah.